all right hi guys welcome back to um another video um thank you for again for tuning in um i've been having so much fun film, filming this um videos for you guys i hope you guys are enjoying them i i enjoying it enjoying them um today i'm going to show you guys how what i usually have for breakfast most for most days um it's going to be nutrient packed it's going to be great tasting it's going to be quick for all my busy moms out there or anybody that's busy we all have busy lifestyles so this should work perfect for anybody that, that's that's busy so it's going to be a nutrient pack delicious delicious um alkaline smoothie that you can have for breakfast or pre as a pre-workout or post-workout whatever whatever time you want to have it you can have it i know it's very good for you for your overall health and this is what i have for most mornings well before i keep rambling let's get into the video and i'm gonna show you how i make my smoothie that's bomb well thank you for watching if you haven't subscribed to the channel yet please make sure you do so and those that have already subscribed i just want to say thank you for subscribing and thank you for watching all right let's get into the video Alrighty, let's get started i'm gonna just open up my um blender right here i know this is, this is old but true and just tested i love 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 this blender i know it's not it's not even very expensive it's pretty cheap but it does the work first we have here this is oatmeal this is a spelt rolled oat i put that in there i have three dates yes three dates I have two bananas. I have a I have a bunch of organic kale in there. Put that in there. Um, I'm gonna put that. Okay. I'm gonna add. Where's my scoop? Right here. Oops. One scoop of hemp seeds in there. One scoop of pumpkin seeds in there I have maca powder if anybody is inquired want to inquire about where I got all this stuff I mostly purchase my stuff from Costco's and Amazon if you want to know I don't put the whole scoop of maca I put like half a scoop of maca in there I like it has this nutty taste that I do like it goes blends well with the hemp seeds which is and it has it's nutrient packed as you can tell all the stuff are, this is like full of protein great omegas and then i have this coconut chunks that i got from trader joe's and i'm gonna put like four of them they're frozen so one two three four and we're just gonna blend everything together you see all this stuff if you want to know where i got this from i'm going to put some links below to as to where you could go buy if you want to purchase from amazon because i buy mine from costco for the most part and i'm gonna add like a cup of water into it and i'll blend everything and i'll show you what it looks like because i don't want you to hear all the noise from the blender so i'm just gonna i'm not gonna show you what it looks like okay so far this is what it is beginning to look like i'm just gonna add a tablespoon of um of this is a Sea moss. I'm gonna add sea moss in there. It's a I like to put like this is nature's estrogen, like they say. Um, I made this myself. If you want to, if you want to see how I clean and prep and make my sea moss, um, leave a comment below and I will show you how you can clean. You can buy your sea moss because I live in New York, so I can just go to a um herbal Jamaican store and they have sea moss over there. I could just buy it clean it and just make my own and I I think the whole bunch that I made the CMOS is like five dollars I bought it for but in the stores you know how pretty expensive and like on Amazon or online you know how pretty pretty expensive they can be I'm just gonna add freshly um squeeze squeeze lime in there because I like the lime taste in my smoothie I'm gonna blend everything together and it should be ready to be served okay okay everyone this is what it looks like oh Blending in is a nice green smoothie. Mm. Delicious, nutrient packed. This is gonna keep you full for hours, especially if you're a gym headed gym person. This is a great, great after workout um, smoothie or even before workout because you need the nutrients in you before you go burn your calories. Delicious, healthy, alkalizing. I know some people are gonna give me flack for using maca. 
like I said, I am not 100% Dr. Say. I don't 100% follow Dr. Savy's re recipe. I know what works for my body, and that's what that's how I, you know, live my life. I go by what I feel like works for my body. And you are more than welcome to not use maca in yours. Use whatever kind of ingredients you want to use in yours. But for me, I like the way the maca tastes, and I like the the other nutritional value that that it brings into into my into my smoothie and into my body so like I said it's a disclosure because I know I'm gonna get a comment I'm gonna get a message saying that that's not part of Dr. Savy's um, nutritional um, guide but it's fine at the end of the day we all have to live our lives the way we see we see fit I feel like some things I add to my to my um I try to go by Dr. Savy's guide but some there's some things I add to and some things I take away there's some things on the list that I don't care too much for with maybe nutritious for for your body but if I can't eat it then what's the point of it I think that other vegetables are also as great so that's that's how I go about doing mine so anyways let me like I said I, I could go on and on but that's so that's the subject for another day thank you again for watching make sure you stay tuned for more videos because I'm gonna be doing more much more because I got a camera so I gotta use it for something thank you thank you thank you subscribe and stay blessed and stay healthy.